Welcome to the series where I show you some of the best top professional camera applications for your phone. This video is a collaboration between FMJ Tech and Gadget Garden. We both made a very cool list of the best out of best DSLR type camera applications for you. Thank you Gadget Kara for being a part of this video. So guys, do check his channel from the link down in the description. With that being said, let's get right into the video. Hello friends, this is Manuraj here from Gadget Kara. So this is a collaboration video with FMJ Tech. Thank you Famil for giving this opportunity. So in this video, we'll be showing you top two photography apps. So without further waste any more time, let's check that out. Okay guys, the first app in the list is ProCam X HD. So this app is available for free in Play Store and you can simply give it a try. So with this app, it will completely turn your phone camera into a professional camera like experience with tons of controls like white balance control, ISO control, focus control, everything at once in this app. So the, this is how the interface looks like. As you can see here, there is a lot of controls which are very easy to use. So this is similar to what you get in like your pro mode in a default camera app but this app like it's like very easy to use for even amateur photographers so here you can simply control the iso so it's very easy to control if you have like very low light you can just simply adjust the iso you also have the option to control the shutter speeds so this comes in handy if you want to take like long exposure shots so the best thing i liked about this app is like when you keep everything to auto it will show like what is the current iso and the what is the current shutter speed when you keep changing the background so moving to the next step in the list is footage camera so this is also available for free in play store and it is worth trying out so if your phone supports like camera to api by default then you can simply leverage this app to get the best results so this is how the user interface looks like and it has got all the functionalities like it has got the burst mode and the raw mode inbuilt with this application and you can just give it a try using that. So moving to the interesting feature which I liked in this app was like to precisely control the focus like in what you get in a DSLR camera. So it will show you the distance between the object and your camera lens and you can precisely control the focus and you will get like very good results. So the other feature which I like the most is like complete control over the video mode. So like while you are recording the video and if you want to switch it to manual focus, you can do that so that you can simply if you want to focus on a particular object, you can turn into like manual focus. And while in the video recording, you will get also full flash features like ISO control and shutter speeds control. Okay guys, that's it for the video. If you want to watch more contents of our channel, you can simply visit the link in the description and if you find it useful, you can subscribe to our channel. Thank you Gadget Kara for your part. Alright, the first camera app in my list is Headscam 2. This has a ton of toggles with all camera controls, especially what I like is the raw file support, DRO2 HDR capability, wide range of resolutions. The customizability that it offers for both video and photos are insane. If you use auto mode itself, you can see the ISO shutter speed that are automatically adjusted by the application depending on the scene. You can lock those settings with this button. It also offers some very useful different types of focusing modes. You can manually adjust the focus like this or you can lock the focusing point to a particular object. For macro type photos, you can choose focusing mode to macro. By manually controlling shutter speed and ISO with manual mod you can take long exposure photos like this you can even use more features like exposure bracketing noise reduction fast burst and many more on the video side you can take truly 4k videos with the easy frame rate control and very great video stabilization one video settings in this that most of the camera application doesn't have is the flat log profile by taking videos in flat log profile you can easily get video footages that have more detail and color grading it in the post production is much simple so definitely check this application moving on the next one in our list is an app called a better camera 
The name itself says that it's a better camera. Well, it is. The interface is so simple, even a person who just got a new phone and doesn't know much about photography can easily use it and get better pictures. This application gives features like exposure compensation, different focusing mode, white balance settings, exposure bracketing, night mode and many more. It's a very nice app with a ton of features, but it does offer some less features compared to the Headscam 2 that I introduced for you guys just now. Just give it a try if you are starting into photography. So that's all for this video. You can visit Gadget Kada channel from the link in the description. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Femil and see you guys in the next one. Bye.